Go ahead. Well, I have no profundity to offer at all. Um, the only thing, when Smithy told me about 20 minutes ago that I was going to be doing this, I thought, well, I could tell my two standard market research jokes, which may or may not uh, amuse you, both of which relate to uh, group discussion uh, circumstances, both of which have something to do, Sylvia, with uh, translation. So, um, one of which uh, I was present at, and the other of which is apocryphal. Which would you prefer first? <laughs> apocryphal. Apocryphal. Okay, apocryphal. I'll get apocryphal. Okay. So, for the apocryphal story, um, the people here have to know something about two things. One thing is the English comic Norman Wisdom. Yes. Better, Mr. Grimstein, you know, you couldn't do that. And the other thing, they have to have a fundamental knowledge of French. Can we go with that? No. I'll tell the story anyway. So this was strong French lager, uh, and it was group discussion. It was happening in the UK. And uh, the French clients were present, so they were in the back room, and there was a translation uh, going on into French in the back room for the purposes of the clients. And uh, the lager was presented and tested and everything, and one of the English respondents said, Bloody hell, he says, you're not going to drink much of that stuff. He says, that is so strong, you wouldn't believe it. You'd be like normal wisdom, you'd be falling over all over. <laughs> In the back room, we had Delhaar say, oh, ce n'est pas possible, c'est assez fort, c'est trop trop fort. C'est juste comme la sagesse no monde. Which is just like the, uh, the wisdom of the Normans. So, um, probably got <laughs> Thank you. It, it may be true, it may not be, I wasn't there. So there was one that I, when, when I worked on the client side of the business, I worked for um, a company called UPS, a logistics uh, organisation, and I was attending some group discussions together with some um, pals of mine from head office here in the UK, in Madrid, I think, in Spain. And so consequently we had the, the Brits in the back room and the translation was obviously uh, into English from Spanish. And uh, the, the group was happening to come to that awful stage that happens in every group. So if it was an animal, what, what would UPS be? If it was a bird, what would UPS be? And so um, we had the translation in the back room. Ah, oh, he's, yeah, okay, he's uh, UPS. If it was a bird, would be, would be eagle. And all the UPS people present immediately said, oh, let that little well light. I said, oh, no, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. He's ostrich. <laughs> And it's true. If, if you look in Spanish, the two words are very, very similar. Anyway, so I, I don't know. <laughs> Anecdotal, that's all. Uh, no more than that. So uh, I've, got, I've got no Thank you, uh, Andy. moral to draw from either of those No, no, stories. of course. Why, why would there be? Why would there be? Yeah. Any, any, any quick question? No? Splendid. Cast your vote. And uh, Anumita. Come to me,